Novak Djokovic has made his future plans clear amid talk that his Covid vaccine stance could force him into an early retirement. Novak Djokovic has dropped a hint about his tennis future amid claims that his vaccine stance could complicate entry into major tournaments. The 34-year-old endured a miserable ordeal in Melbourne last month, when his attempts to retain the Australian Open were stopped in their tracks as he was deported before his campaign got underway. Djokovic was forced to sit out the Aussie Open, as Big Three rival Rafael Nadal lifted the trophy to take his Grand Slam haul to an unprecedented 21 titles. The Serb is expected to encounter more complications at Indian Wells, and potentially the French Open too, after opening up on his opposition to mandated Covid vaccines. Fans and respected figures have speculated on his future in the sport as he prepares to return to competitive action at the Dubai Tennis Championships next week. And in a recent interview, Djokovic stated that he has plans leading all the way up until 2024, which suggests that his prospective retirement could be over two years away. An Olympic medal, especially gold, is always a big wish, he told Radio Television of Serbia. Unfortunately, I didn't have a chance to fight for it in the past. I plan to be in Paris in 2024. I re-wound my match with Alexander Zverev in Tokyo many times, trying to figure out what went wrong. I played superbly up to that point, but I did feel I was running on fumes, both mentally and physically. With a bronze medal to show for his Olympic career so far. The Serb clearly has ambitions to add a gold to his collection, which would require him to play on until the age of 37. Grand slams are seemingly on his mind too, despite last month's ordeal which saw him kept in a Melbourne detention centre for several days. Australian Immigration Minister Alex Hawke even stepped in to personally deport the tennis sensation on public interest grounds. But the nine-time Aussie Open champion is seemingly prepared to put it behind him, and has expressed a desire to return to the country who, according to his mother, kept him in conditions of torture while awaiting clearance to play. I will always remember all the nice things that have happened to me in Melbourne, added Djokovic. Despite all this, I have a great connection with Australia. Results that I have had in Melbourne in the past show you how I feel when I go there. Everything that has happened this year was totally unexpected. It will be hard to forget, but I want to come back to Australia in the future and to play at the Rod Lava Arena again.